Hello and welcome to day nine. Yes, we're coming to the end of these beautiful keys. And this is also a very exciting one. As this is in a way an upgrade. An upgrade of you to open up really your possibilities to be homo luminous, to step into your light body. But with this comes, of course, some other things that I'm simply putting out to you, to inspire you. This new body is healing differently. It's, it's just different in many ways. So from my own experience, I can tell you that food has changed a lot for me. Although I kind of got stuck and I'm very happy to got stuck with raw and plant-based, more plant-based than raw now, but still on that same journey i feel now if i do eat something that doesn't fit my body tells me so here i'm encouraging you in in your praxis part as you're upgrading into your becoming that that you really start noticing what works for your body and what doesn't it's so easy to be a custom you know that your tummy's hurting, maybe you have gases, whatever. You get a headache. Just be conscious. Could it be food related? Is it something that you eat that your body doesn't like? It's maybe because you are upgrading. Most of the most important thing, obviously, is always processed food and, and a lot of pesticides. Are you taking medication? Just be a little bit more conscious. We all don't need to be raw and vegan or plant-based or vegetarian. It's not about this. This is about being really conscious what is acceptable for your body and not. And as your body is changing, I can assure you, and I'm sure many of you here know that. Watch it. And make the little twists that allow you to be the vital being that you can be. The second part of that is, of course, the movement. And that is just so crucial. You have been given this beautiful body that is now even shifting into a higher frequency. But it comes with a few responsibilities. And movement is surely, surely, surely one of them. So I don't know what you do. It's not really about what you do. It's about that you do it. Move that body. Use that body. Even if you go only for a 20-minute walk every day or if you go on the mat for 21 minutes minimum, that's what we do, three times seven minutes, do something. That body needs to be moved. And trust me, it will be very grateful to you when you're actually doing all these things. So in addition today, we're going to get you into this beautiful upgrade that maybe will give you a little bit more grit, that, that little extra inspiration, encouragement, determination, persistence to actually be that, to, to be part of your own vitality, to, to choose it very consciously to, to be really the observer of what's going on and to do the best for you. And that's part of self-love, of course. So now let us take you on this journey to your upgrade. Let's meditate. In our meditation today, we will upgrade and attune to your homo luminous so that you can begin your transformation from homo sapiens, the woman or the man of the mind that you have been into the homo luminous, the woman or the man of the light and the heart that you are becoming. 
So at the end of this, you could walk away as Homo Luminous. The invitation is here. So let's open sacred space. Calling in a seven-dimensional Merkaba around you. The double pyramid intertwined. Tune in in this beautiful Merkaba. The Merkaba becomes your vessel to take you into the temple of light above Machu Picchu in Peru. As you are entering, you get showered with golden and white light, and you are welcomed by the Laika, the Inca who dreamed so much into being, including Homo Luminous. Pachacute Inca and Huascar, as well as Serapis Bay and Merlin, and they are here to initiate you into the Homo Luminous. Tera koshe te amat guarda marikera undare shita shita marea ukayamayo nariyo ma koshtare namirara koshta naya estori karendare inda kushti amare hastio tira mararuka yamade. Ashi o marae korai maro uta shea, aia ai koshtia marae. Toria tia maie ho, naia koia maia. Oshtare patira patihi, no amane akotaia. Mana ho na kiro. One of the present masters gives you now the key. The key number nine. The key to your homo luminous and gold print so you can unlock your master self and your role listening and trusting your intuition and truths. Place it in your heart. So you can cultivate and open up more into your frequency and your being as a homo luminous. Remember, you can leave now as homo luminous in the making. Share your gratitude with the masters. Enjoy and embrace. And then step back into your seventh dimensional Merkaba around you, fully conscious, fully sinking and integrating your activation and your key to unlock the stars, your homo luminous, your master self. And when you're ready, blink your eyes open and smile. Namaste. Namaste.